Chair, uh, I want to go to page 37 of the annual report under performance measures. Um, I'm always a big fan of seeing a performance measure that's hit 100% of the time, 100% of the time. Um, but I am curious, because when I read the second last paragraph, it talks about the performance measure um, excluding disputed amounts uh, until all outstanding matters are resolved and, and uh, retroactively adjusted if necessary. It, it, how valuable is this performance measure? It, it, are, you, are you not really saying 100% of companies who pay on time pay on time? Great. Um, what we're talking about in here with the, um, the royalties that are under dispute are the, it's in the normal course of business. Um, when, uh, when we do audits of royalties, um, sometimes uh, corporations will, will disagree or dispute our interpretation of the regulations or the royalty, you know, royalty regulation compared to their interpretation of regulations. Um, we take those out until the dispute is, is finalized and we come to an agreement with the, with the companies as to what's the actual royalties. So that's why we pulled that amount out. Mm. So does this mean that the production data reported by oil and gas producers to AER and to the department, are you confident that that production data is 100% accurate and, and how do you know that it is? So the AER has a responsibility of um, collecting their volumes produced or the production data is produced. Um, they provide to us um, on a regular basis a report um, talking about their, um, their efforts they've taken to verify their royalty volumes reported to them. Okay. And uh, would, would it perhaps be a, a more valuable measure if, we did, if you did in fact include disputed amounts? Uh, I mean, is that information tracked anywhere in... Um, in either the annual report or internally in the department? Uh, the dispute amounts are tracked internally. Um, uh, our view is that this, this is a, a disputed amount is just regular business. Um, it, it's, a, it's the same item as if, when you file your personal tax return and you mm -hmm. dispute your personal tax return with CRA. Um, it's just regular course of business. Um, that's why we don't include it in here um, until it's settled. I guess in terms of tracking trends, though, over time, I mean, I guess I would, you know, as a legislator, would find it perhaps more useful to see what the trend of disputed amounts is over time. Uh, and, and so, again, you know, while I don't, uh, you know, I, I'm, 